No, no, no you don't! <laughs> and Nuba bombed you, bitch ass. Let's come at you, boy. Uh! Oh, yeah, look at that. We have the new Monarchy 1 faction rally for Destiny 2 this week, which I'm glad to see that not everyone wants to be a spacey moon like I was last time, but this time, new Monarchy 1, and I have a full new Monarchy wizard set look at that oh the new monarchy set and right in this right now in this game looks absolutely amazing you can get like a better like full body view of this whole thing but it is fantastic looking I mean, like the gold red and gold look amazing it's just like one of the best armor sets i could possibly get from the F faction rally which not gonna lie i did do the uh little cheat code or not the cheat code but the cheese right there to kind of just run back and forth and get the rally stuff but hey it took me like 500 credits to get all this stuff so that tells you how rare it is to get everything here so since new monarchy won that means we have the honors edge as the gift to everybody for who you know pledged to new monarchies like my warlock did and the thing with the honors edge sword guard has low efficiency and high defense and another perk of with this weapon is that quick attacks immediately after swapping to the sword do additional damage so I'm guessing it's something maybe kind of along the lines of Rampage, but the kind of more, more involved with swapping to it. Um, I don't know how much extra damage it will be, but we'll see. And uh, I figure we're just doing and doing all monarchy, all new monarchy set playthroughs. So I'm gonna be running with that. I have the Royal Disposition 2 SMG, and I also will be using the Song of Justice 6, in which if you want to compare it to the Mita, that's pretty much how it looks. Uh, much better rage and impact, but everything else, it's uh, it's hit rather hard. So we'll see how well it does. Uh, the whole the perk on this one is uh, for the Song of Justice is that it, uh, but the holstered weapon is automatically reloaded after a short period of time. So, anyways, guys, let's jump into some Crucible and we'll see how it goes. All right, looks like our first match here is on Javelin Four. Let's go rock this new Monarchy full set here and see how well we do. Ooh, there we go. That was like a two-shot kill on that guy. I like that a lot. A lot of recall on this gun, but it seems to do all right. There we go. There's another kill. All right. This thing hits like a truck. Oh, too many guys. Run away. Oh, here we go. Time to use the sword here. That's a pretty sweet-looking sword, though. Look at that. Because it's just... It's, it's sharp. That's what it is. I'm going to come around the corner. Abuse third-person camera angles. Yeah. There we go. That was a headshot. I'll take it. There we go. Royal disposition. Looking out all right, right there. Looking out all right. I did forget to mention my uh, stat loadout. As um, my, since the new monarchy set is actually built for speed, and so uh, my speed actually right now in the game is at. Rank cranked all the way up to 10 and then uh, my uh, resilience is at zero I don't really see that much of a benefit with resilience whoa lag okay well that works because <laughs> uh, I think with resilience you may be able to survive like a couple extra bolt make like one or two extra bullets I haven't really seen much of a downfall for not having a whole high of resilience and so uh, I got that back down to zero actually and then my recovery is at six which normally I try to my other build I have I usually keep it around seven way I have things set up right now can't do that so much usually I also have with the speed build I would run with both Midas and use a transverse of step to get that extra boost of speed I think I come my way I'm, I'm whoring the radar right now here he comes no 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 you don't <laughs> and Nuba bombed you, bitch ass. Let's come at you, boy. Uh! Ooh, pulse nade, a little too strong there for me. Oh, he had the hammer. He had the electro smash. I don't really know as much in the way, obviously, of uh, damage boost. When it comes to using the sword, 
because, well, it uh, kills in like one hit. So like, well, the damage boost really isn't that useful. What? Oh, I hit him, okay. I was like, how did I not hit that guy? Are they coming my way? Oh boy, here they come. <laughs> yes, I got him! <laughs> Get wrecked! Third person camera angles for the win. Oh, we lost by one kill. Man, that was a close match. That was fun. Let's get another match in. You know, we gotta test out these uh, this new monarchy set up a little more. Alright, here we are on the remake of Distant Shores. Now, this map really isn't... Maybe not the best for a sword, but, you know, we gotta make it work. It's the new Monarchy playthrough, man. We gotta test all the new weapons and armor and all that good stuff here. Let's get going. There we go. Finally got a kill. Pick up a little crest action here. Ooh, I can as. Here we go. Yes! Oh, no, no, no! I thought someone was hiding in the corner! No! Leave me alone! No! Oh, I got you. I'm gonna get this guy. Ah! Where is he? There he is! There we go. Oh, you got right ahead of me. Let's go get that guy. We gotta be, we gotta be more strategic, though. I played almost like the sword back in Halo 2. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Yeah! <laughs> Even with the shotgun, you can't stop me. You can't stop me. How about my friend? With a slice! You can call me Gordon Ramsay the way I'm chopping up these noobs. Like fresh veggies. Really, when you have a sword, you can actually just run around with it and then you can peek corners without exposing yourself and then swap to your primary. No! I missed! Oh, I still got him! Yes! <laughs> Currently tied 33 to 33. Tight match here. Let's see if we can get a few more crests going our way. And that was a fail. And you fail. Yes, that was absolutely awful. Oh no! Oh, I thought he was gonna get, sm get a good smash on us, but it wasn't happening. He's like, let me smash. I'm like, no. Your tail sucks. Your tail is small. But let me smash, Becky. I don't know if you guys have seen that video. If you, ne you need to see it. Just type in Lemmy Smash. Smash. Oh my god! How did he hit me? I swear to god, there's like some crazy magnetism that happens with that freaking throwing knife from hunters nowadays. Like, I remember back in Destiny 1, man, that was actually kind of like a that was like a skill shot. Now, they just, they just throw it down the hallway. It will connect. Oh, come on, we're only down by one. One crest. Oh my god, we lost by one again! Anyways guys, that was some a little taste of the new Monarchy sets that you can get up here in Destiny 2. Hopefully you guys were able to win the Honor's Edge as well. It's a pretty sweet sword. I certainly enjoyed it. Though I think the perks on it aren't really necessarily that great for PvP, PvP, but maybe in PvE, maybe a little bit better. But I enjoyed the extra speed from the armor set. That's pretty sweet. Uh, the scout rifle that we were using, uh, let me just double check on the name again. Uh, Song of Justice. It's it's good at long range. Like if you can you know cross map kind of halfway across the map kind of people, make sure you get in those long lines of sight. Uh, you'll be more of like an anchor, I would say. You can't really be moving around being real super aggressive. Uh, Royal Disposition, it's solid. That's a solid SMG. I didn't see any problem with that at all. I thought it was great. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. If you want to see some more content from me, check out the videos on the screen right now. Subscribe for more awesomeness. Leave a comment down below what you thought about. Leave a like if you want to help out the channel. We'll catch you all in the next video. Peace out.